Good morning, students. How are you? I hope all of you are well. In this series of practical, today we will do the practical number four. In this practical, we have to predict the future value using data from newspaper on traffic. So first of all, we have to fill the data in A2 cell. Here we have to write year, and then. In B2 cell, we have to write the vehicle density. Density. D E N S I T Y. Okay. And now we have to fill the year. We have to fill the data that is collected from the newspaper. 2011 and so on. From the newspaper. I had filled the data that is in year 2010 the vehicle density is 27.88 2011 vehicle density is 30.33 and 2012 vehicle density is 32.78 and from the newspaper we had I had filled this data and now we have to select the cell the from A3 to A14 and now click on insert that is on the scatter diagram that is here scatter and now click on this scatter and then click on this we get the scatter diagram for this and now we have to draw a trend line on this dot we have to click the right add trend line and and now on this trend line option we have to click on linear and and after that that is an display equation on the chart and then click okay just wait and now we have to close this and therefore in this graph we get the trend line and this series 1 we get the trend line here and this is the equation of trend line okay and now this and now we have to fill this that is in this cell we have to fill that is equal to the trend line is 1.990 star that is multiplied with a15 minus 39 Because this trend line equation is y is equal to 1.99x minus 3971, and then press enter. We get the value 52.78. And now copy this and paste on this B16 cell, and then press enter, and we get the vehicle density 54.77. For the year 2023, that means in this way we can we can predict the trend values, that means the future values of the vehicle density. Okay, I hope you understand this. Thanks and have a nice day.